What is up and welcome to today's vlog. Time to answer some questions. I made it pretty obvious and in the description as well, yet some people don't read or pay attention to the vlog. Monica and Elliot are pregnant. They announced on Christmas on Instagram, on Monica's Instagram with this picture. It was really funny, really clever. We found out like the day they did. It was a lot of fun and they actually know what they're having. I'm editing a video for her to share with her friends and I'm sure she'll post it on her Instagram. Just do it, do it, you have it right there. I don't want to. <laughs> she already told her family and we were there for the moment as well. Very exciting, I can't remember if she's due in June or May. June, I think. But we obviously love them and are super happy and excited for them. And I know a lot of you guys do too. Enjoy their company in the vlogs and them as people. They're great people. And then, while we were home, Jen felt sick. Which is normal. You feel sick every once in a while. But when I was asking her about it, it was almost like she was like pregnant sick. When we got pregnant with Ezra, you guys know it was kind of a surprise to us. We were doing different things to prevent. And then all of a sudden it was like, whoa! You're having a baby. This time we are playing full court press defense on prevention. We thought really nothing of it when Jenica was feeling sick. Then a couple days later, she felt the same way. And then that's when we were all kind of like, including my mom and Courtney, like, whoa, this seems a little different. Okay. I'm a little shaky right now because I just took a freaking pregnancy test. You guys are freaking out. I felt sick last week. Just thought it was just like, Coming here, stress, all that stuff. And then today I started feeling sick again, and now everyone's thinking, saying, "What well, if you're pregnant? What well, if you're pregnant?" And now I'm freaking out because if I'm pregnant, I might freaking lose it. So I'm on the pill, TMI. I'm taking a pill to not get pregnant. So I'm a little nervous. I don't think I am. I really don't think I am. But I'm freaking out because what if I am? I can't be. I can't be. Everyone has these like times after they have a baby where your body's regulating and your body's kind of freaking out, you know, and trying to get back to normal. So, I think I'm gonna oh crap, oh. And so, you know, you just, your body's just whack after a baby. And so a lot of people take pregnancy tests just to make sure they're not pregnant, you know. I don't think I am, please say not pregnant, please. Oh, it's still thinking, it's still thinking, it's still thinking, which is a good thing. I think if it's still thinking, I think it's gonna be a not pregnant. Which is making me feel better. But. Oh, I'm seriously like shaking. I'm seriously shaking right now. I don't think I am. I think it's negative. It would have, I think it would have already come up positive. Oh gosh. I feel like I'm gonna throw up. No, wait. No, okay. 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 I can calm down. I'm just not ready to be pregnant. I might even be done having babies with Ezzy. So. Just a little scary, but it says no, I think. It says no, <laughs> okay. All right, okay, okay, okay. Should I trick Sam? <laughs> if I trick him, then he'll definitely know it's negative. I should, I should trick him in my, oh gosh. Oh, then why am I feeling sick? It's weird. Bodies are weird. I'm just grateful to just enjoy my baby while he's a baby. To enjoy him. <laughs> it's a no. Oh my <laughs> gosh. Jen. I freak out. Jen's like coming down the hall and she's like. She was way too happy. Way too happy. Yeah, I would have been crying. I would have been. I'm seriously shaking. I'm seriously shaking. Stop that. Are you sweating? Let me see your armpits. <laughs> oh. You paused and took out the camera. I was freaking out. Oh my gosh. It was thinking for a while, and so I'm like, okay. It's it's the minority view, but a couple of people were like offended that Jenica felt the need to take a test, even questioned that she might be. But guess what? With Ezra, we didn't expect it. I used the analogy that I made up myself 
if here in our hometown there was a breakout of measles or something that I have a vaccine to, I would still be a little bit worried. And if I noticed a rash or bumps starting to show up on my skin, I'd be like, whoa, maybe I should go take a test. I think it's perfectly reasonable to have a little bit of concern. Anyways, our life has always been kind of full of surprises, so it was kind of nice for it to be boring on this day. <laughs> Where are we going, guys? going home with the best two weeks and now all the fun must come to an end. We're heading home to the airport. Hopefully the uh, flight goes well and we get all our bags checked <laughs> because all of our bags are a little heavy. But all that, good. all that Christmas is packed up in suitcases, a little heavy. Yep, the kids have their backpacks. Is that going to help us get in? Can we pop up? Yeah. Yep. So we've got the other car of our family following us and they're gonna help us get to the airport so that they can have their car back that we're driving. <laughs> yeah. We made it home! It feels so good to be home. Although we're really sad to leave. Like no part of us wanted to leave, but it just feels good to be back in our space and our place. I feel refreshed and recharged. Do you feel refreshed and recharged? Yes, I feel like I'm ready to conquer a new year. Yeah, I'm ready to get that. What? Yeah. <laughs> Today's travel went really, really well though. As he slept for about a third of the flight, the kids were really good. There was no tears. Yeah. There was no fighting. No, it was good. There was no nothing. Everyone was so good. You guys were so good. They are becoming yeah. little professional flyers. They yes. They're really good yeah. agents. We'll have to go on some fun trips. Huh. Ew, your feet stink. That's those boots. <laughs> yeah. BJ loves her boots. Some of the Christmas toys are already leaking their way out. I saw a couple comments asking, how do we get everything home? Yeah. We had planned ahead, so we actually brought an extra suitcase just for Christmas. We had four suitcases in total, and they probably were about 200 pounds. We were almost at 50 pounds for each one. Oh yeah, literally every suitcase was about 40, I got 49 pounds. Did you see insane. my stuff? But we did it, and we we're did home. It. And we're home. We could have done eight suitcases because we flew Southwest. We actually love Southwest, not a brand deal. But because they give you two free bags. So we had four bags, seven items in total, but we could have had eight bags. Anyways, that's how we did it. And we got everything except for one of the presents from my mom to Jenica, which my mom is going to ship out. It was just a little too big for the suitcase. Can you see my stuff like that? What? So this is not like a paid brand deal or anything, but you guys know that we did uh, work with Stitch Fix. We came back to packages from them. They sent us gifts for the holidays. They arrived like right before we left. So this is kind of fun because we're coming back to packages. They must have enjoyed working with us because they sent us gifts. That's There's nice. a lot of boxes. It's like wrapped, wrapped wow. like Wow, like an actual <laughs> present. Ooh. Ooh, what is it, what is it? Oh, it's a little nice sweater. Ooh, that's nice. Thank you, Stitch Fix. Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas. So, I thought you guys would enjoy seeing what they sent us. Oh, those are sweet. Oh, those are perfect for here. These are so perfect. I want some of these for now so bad. Are those like, are those rhinos or sharks? A rhino. Ooh, let's see what else you got. Whoa. Whoa. Look, it has googly eyes. Stretchy pants. Ooh. Ooh. Soft jeans or stretchy jeans, Noah, you'll like those. Sometimes you wear stretchy pants. Ooh, really nice shirt. Polo shirt. That's cute. Oh, sweatpants. He's for fun. Another dinosaur Well, that's like my shirt. That's like what I'm wearing right now, but it has a dinosaur. Oh, this is really cute. And? Thank you. <laughs> Wait, who's that for? Well, yeah, it says hi Penelope. Ooh. <gasps> Cute! What size are they? I'm a Christmas. You wanted these for Christmas? PJ <laughs> got her gift opening from her mama. Yeah. <laughs> so appreciative of everything. What, what the heck? Okay, let's go over each one. <gasps> Cute oh, wow. sweatshirt with a skirt. Oh my goodness, there's so much in it. Like it's oh, it's legging skirt. That oh, way. Oh, you like that. You love that. You were a little dressed as a Cute, anyway. huh? You want to wear it now? Oh, 
lot of love. Is this a work? Oh, oh a little sw a little jacket. Another workout tee. A little puppy. We have puppy, and we like that show. You like you, that? You watch that show? Yeah. It's puppy dog. Puppies. Oh, that, really. really. that's true though. The same type of dog. <gasps> Oh, it's oh, a dress, dress now. It's kind of like the shirt you got before, but it's a dress. Ooh, look at this pretty flower dress, sis. <laughs> She's drooling. Look at this one. I love that style dress. Oh, she got a couple got of those daddy. last time. Little pants to go with your shirt. Yeah. Workout pants. You love them. She <laughs> loves those workout <laughs> pants. <laughs> Came home to five boxes from there. Oh, they're so, so nice. Amazing. Open. Oh, I think this is for you. It's for me? That is so nice. Beautiful black scarf too. Oh my goodness, look how pretty. I thought Good thing it's been cold here. <laughs> yeah, it's been really cold. It's been almost cool. as cold here as Ew. it has been in oh, Chicago. Oh, everybody thing off, please. It's like one of like the oversized ones. Ooh, it's so soft. Nope. It's like a blanket. Stitch Fix Influencer Team, thank you for sending that to us. That's pretty much all the kids have been wearing and I've been wearing a lot of my clothes too, so thank you guys. <laughs> Are you wearing your are you wearing your Stitch Fix pants right now? Every day. We gotta take down Christmas and we gotta talk about our goals because I have like how many goals do I have, Jen? Oh my gosh, like I got like 30. I got some serious goals for this year. Going home was good for my soul. It filled la pila. I'm ready to rock. We gotta clean up this mess now and unpack. It's good to be home though. I guess a lot of people here have been traveling up north like an hour or so just to play with the snow because it hasn't snowing in in many parts of Arizona, except for where we live. Hope you guys enjoyed today's video. We'll see you guys next time. Peace.